Good morning, folks. Hey, the old fisherman's back with you. I want to show you. We uh, last couple of nights we've caught a few crawfish, not a lot, but probably about 30 or so. And uh, I want to show you what they look like, and I'm gonna show you the trap that I built to do so. Uh, we built a uh, about a two foot trap. Uh, you see it, it's got a little hack in the front, and you got a little tunnel for them to go in. And on each side, there's a tunnel for them to go in. And it's kind of slanted up, a two inch, a little bit over two inch square tunnel. And it's slanted up. I don't know if you can see it or not. But uh, hope you can see it. It's slanted up. And, uh, and on each side, you got a little tunnel. And at the end, we got a tunnel. We got four tunnels. And then at the top, what I've done is I got me a little trap door to be able to pull them out. See, little trap door, got a little bungee cord, slides down, and you uh, you pin it at the top. Uh, and I made this trap just to see if I could catch me a mess of crawfish. And I wanted to fish with crawfish. I tried it, didn't work. Uh, I caught a couple stripers on the flutter spoon, but not a bite on the crawfish. So that fooled me on that one, but I had to let you know. Uh, but we, we caught some crawfish in this trap last night at my sister's dock and i got little clips of it i messed up making my clips and i turned the camera upside down but i'm gonna try to put together a little clip of, of some of this uh, catching of crawfish but glad y'all could be with the old fisherman now i'm gonna show you what we call see here there's your crawfish and i'm gonna show you some of them some of them are huge uh some of them are really big look at here what a crawfish look at that He's still alive. I had them on some ice, so they're cold and they're dormant. But right here's one that's waking up. And look at the pinches on that joker. Look at the size of that. Now, that's big, ain't it? That's a pretty joker. We're going to find out how good they are. I never eat much crawfish. I've, I've tasted them a long time ago. but uh, And we got a bucket full of them. We probably got three dozen crawfish. See them? That's what we caught with our trap. We went through a lot of effort. Uh... You're supposed to check them every 30 minutes or so. I can't do that. I put it in and check it this morning, in the mornings, and uh, we caught a few. But there they are, and uh, you see them right there, crawfish. But uh, I'm going you know, to have a little clip showing uh, the place we caught them at. My sister's dock uh, is a gazebo, and they, and they like it in shallow water. I went down there and I looked over and I could see them at dark. I could see them with a the light all around the bank. So you can see them, you can spot them. She's got rip wrap and then there's a little flat area. You want to try to set it as flat to the bottom as you can in a couple, in less than two foot of water. Uh, you can go a little deeper out from the rocks, but you got to get it flat. Uh, but anyhow, we caught a mess of them and I'm gonna show them to you again. See them down in there? We are gonna try to eat them jokers tonight. See how they taste. They tell me that you can uh, boil them for about eight, seven, eight minutes in boiling water. And uh, and then you put, you, of course, you got your seasoning, your crab boil or your uh, crawfish boil in there. And uh, now I don't, I might not be right with what I'm saying, but this is what they tell me. I don't know. This is all new to me. And uh, you let them set like uh, salt and, and put salt in it too and, and let them set afterwards and let them absorb all the uh content that you got in the crab ball and it makes them really delicious so we're gonna give them a shot hey glad y'all could be with the old fisherman fishing's still off i really ain't catching a lot i did make a i did make a video yesterday caught four stripers actually i caught five one of them wasn't on camera but uh we caught a lemon but they were small they two pound a piece pound a half two pound not real big but uh i might put that up but thanks for being with the old fisherman and, and bear with me we'll get some videos coming up soon i hope and uh, and thank you for being with me. See ya. Well, folks, the old fisherman's back with you. We walking down to the dock where he uh, put his crawfish uh, trap out last night. And we're gonna see if we got any. Uh, I come up here in the middle of the night and I had a bunch of them around it. They didn't act like they wanted to go in it. And I brought a little bucket here and, uh, and we caught one in it last night. See him right there? He's still alive. See him? We're going to pull it over. And, uh, hey, I see some down there in it. It's a few in it. See the trap? See the red up in the top? 
Hey, let's pull it in and see what we got. I'm gonna have to lay the camera down. Oh, I ain't got my, but I got it on a string. And uh, bear with me a second. Old fisherman has got 20 or 25 in the doggone trap as we speak. Look at this. Look at the size of that one climbing up there. Look at that. Huh? Look at that. Look at that. Look down in the, over on this side. Look at them. And something. Oh my. Hey, so it was a success. I'm gonna lay it down. I'm gonna try to undo the. I got to I got to undo the wires back. Get them. Look in that bucket. Look in that bucket. Look in that bucket. We're gonna throw these old uh, heads and stuff out. For them to eat turtles to eat. Look in here. Look in there. That's what we caught in our trap last night. I never handled a doggone crawfish before. Hey, they'll probably bite you. Fisherman's back with you. I pulled my crawfish trap. You see crawfish in that trap. See them in there? Yeah. We caught uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten crawfish is all we got. I had six last night in about 30 minutes. That's 16 more crawfish. And uh, some of them pretty good size. And we got a couple turtles in there too. Turtles and crawfish. Huh? Yes, sir. Hey, early in the morning, we going back fishing again this morning. Hadn't been catching that many, but uh, I tried crawfish yesterday and uh, never got a bite. I couldn't believe it. I tell you, they're too big. These are big crawfish. So we're going to try eating these jokers. I got almost, I got 21 yesterday, so we're going to try eating these jokers maybe tonight or tomorrow night. But look how big that joker is right there. Look at that, look at that sucker. Huh? That's a big one, ain't he? Look at that thing. Hey, day. Now that's a whopper. Look like a lobster. Look at them pinchers. Them pinchers are huge. Look at the size of them pinchers. Oh, my. He's mad, too. He's going to be madder than that when I eat on him. Look at that. That's another one. Look at that. Huh? Look at that. But we re we, we uh, redone our trap. We got little hacks in it. Uh, you can't, you're not allowed, but two-inch hacks, around a two-inch hack, and five traps per person, and I don't have but one trap. And we're on my sister's dock, uh, gazebo. There's another little opening. You see where they go up in there? Probably a lot of them got out last night, is what I'm thinking. But uh, first 30 minutes, I caught six. That sucker right there. Huh. <laughs> He's mad. But uh, like I say, let me count them again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Might be 10 in there. 11, might be 11, I see one out there. They're hard to count in there, but it's brown. Red and brown is what they are. Red and brown. Look at them they're fighting. Oh my, probably been fighting each other all night long. Tell you what, they done picked that uh, fish, little pieces of white perch, uh, and a couple little brim I had stuck in there. We got them fighting. There's something in it. Hey, thanks for being with the old fisherman. Uh, we going fishing. Fish hadn't been biting that good, but we going fishing. We'll see if we can catch a few more. And if I do, I'll put a video up. Thanks a lot for being with the old fisherman.